that Apple is working on a paid AI health guide that could help you improve how you exercise, sleep, and eat, which has the code name Quartz, will use AI and data from an Apple Watch to make suggestions and create coaching programs for each user. But Quartz won't be released this year. Instead, it will be released next year. Bloomberg's report talks about a number of new health efforts, including the new Quartz service and app. As part of iPadOS 17, the health app will finally have a version that is just for the iPad. Apple is also working on an emotion tracker that is different from the rumored journaling app and new tools to help people who are nearsighted. Apple didn't answer right away when asked for response. These new tools would add to the rising number of health-related tools that Apple is putting into its devices. Last year, it added the ability to keep track of medications, and its paid Fitness Plus service adds new workouts every week. I like the yoga classes offered by the service. And it looks like there are more health tools on the way. Supposedly, the company's mixed reality headset will work with Fitness Plus and have a nap for meditation. Apple is also said to be making work on non-invasive blood glucose monitoring, but we might have to wait a long time for that to happen. The Wall Street Journal says that Apple could have its own journaling app in the next update to iOS. The software, which has the code name Jurassic, will try to take advantage of the benefits that logging your thoughts and actions regularly seems to have for your mind and body. The WSJ says that the app could be announced at Apple's Worldwide Developers Conference in June as a feature for iOS 17, the software update for the iPhone that is expected to come out this fall. The WSJ says that one of Apple's ideas for the app is for it to use information about how the user uses their iPhone to make tips about what they might want to write about in their journal. It might notice when a person's daily routine has changed and suggest that they write about something like a workout. There's even talk of a tool called All Day People Discovery that could help users find friends and co-workers they spend a lot of time with. Day One founder Paul Main told the WSJ after hearing about Apple's plans for Jurassic. It will most definitely give us some competition. Apple is making a health advice service called Quartz that will use AI. AI and data from the Apple Watch will be used by the Quartz service to keep people inspired to work out, eat better, and sleep better. It is said that the ABACT coaching service will keep people inspired to work out, eat better, and sleep better. The likely monthly fee-based coaching service will use artificial intelligence AI and data from Apple Watch to get the information it needs. The news agency story also said that several teams at Apple are working on the project, such as the Health, Siri, and AI teams. We don't know when it will come out, but it should be sometime next year. Apple GPS's ability to make it easier for people with disabilities to use is a key feature. Its ability to understand and produce text, graphics, and speech may also make it easier and more effective for people with disabilities to interact. People who can't see could use Apple GPT to have text read out loud or pictures described, and people who can't speak could use it to make speech for them. People with disabilities may have a much better quality of life if they can talk to each other more successfully and freely. Apple GPT could have a big effect on the future of work in a number of ways. In addition to how it might affect accessibility, it might be able to automate many repetitive tasks and give people more time to focus on more difficult and creative work. Because it can generate code and do multiple things at once, this could have a big effect on the workforce. Apple GPT's ability to understand many languages is another important feature. This means that it can accurately process and produce text in a number of languages. Businesses and organizations that work in different countries and languages need to think about what this means. Processes and make them work better Apple GPT offers ways to communicate in more than one language Apple GPT has advanced skills for generating natural language, as well as being able to write in more than one language means that it can make writing that sounds normal and is similar to how people speak. This could be used in many places, like customer service, marketing and advertising lessons Apple GPT could be used, for example, to make customized product descriptions and ideas for online shoppers or to answer specific questions from customers in a chat box as part of customer service. 
Apple GPT can be used as well. In the field of creative writing, it has the potential to be used to come up with full shirt stories or novels, as well as writing prompts. This is useful for authors and other creative people who are looking for ideas or trying to speed up their creative process. Another interesting thing about Apple GPS is that it can understand and create rich media information, like photos and movies. Apple GPT's natural language processing is so good that it can understand the content of an image or movie and write a text description that sounds natural. This could be used in a lot of different areas, like social media marketing. Apple GPT could be used for business and e-commerce. For example, to make captions for posts on social media or to instantly make text or photos that describe something. In an online shopping catalog, Apple GPT can handle images and videos as well as understand and produce speech. This could be used for voice help and translating languages. Apple GPT, for example, could be used to power a voice assistant that can understand and answer complex questions in natural language or to quickly translate speech between two languages. Overall, Apple GPT is an amazing and interesting development in the field of artificial intelligence that has the potential to completely change how we talk to each other and connect. Apple GPT is a serious competitor in the AM market because it has special features like being able to process rich media content and understand speech. It is also a tool that could change how businesses, researchers, and people interact with their eyes. However, like any new technology, it could also pose risks and cause problems, including bias in the dart it learns from, and the chance of bad things happening it will be important for companies to take steps to reduce these risks and make sure their AI language models are used in a fair and responsible way. Apple's GPT is a big step forward in artificial intelligence that could change how we talk to each other and use technology. It can understand and create rich media content and is good at processing language. It's a powerful tool that can be used in a lot of different ways. Make sure to subscribe to our channel and turn on the notification bell so you don't miss out.